Dear students, in this video, we will see mock test of computer awareness questions. See, you can attempt a mock test uh, released by the Telangana Education uh, Common Interested Board, that is TSCERT. Uh, now, when you go down here, the official website of the Telangana uh, Council of Education Research and Training, you will find that a like, mock test is given here. When you click on this mock test, it will show you a login. It is like a practice test before you go and attempt for an online. Students should be aware because some of the students may not know about how to use this online test and all. So you just click on the sign sign in, uh, then the test will start. So 150 questions will be available. A timer will be there. A countdown timing will be there. So you practice this one. Now we will start here. Mock test for uh, the questions which are given in the mock test. 2025 computer awareness the same questions I have copied here and I am trying to explain the answers here. Now first one see this is the first question given in the computer awareness in the mock test which of the following devices stores instructions that help the computer start up right and this I already explained in my previous uh, computer awareness videos right we have ROM read only memory what is read only memory it is a memory fixed by the manufacturer where it contains some code known as firmware. ROM is the answer. Additional information is ROM contains a firmware that is a software kept by the manufacturer or the company which uh, manufactured this ROM read only memory chips. So this is useful to start the computer. So the correct answer is read only memory. Second question, which type of software would you use software would you use to make computer perform a specific task such as writing a letter or drawing pictures. So we are using a software like MS Word or some paint or some Photoshop like this software. So these softwares are known as application softwares, right? Applica softwares which we use for making CVs like Excel, like Photoshop, these are known as application softwares. Question number three. You can use this output device when you need only to see information. Output device. That means when a user want to see something, he want to see something. Only she want to see. He don't want to print on the paper. He want to see. So where we will see? On the monitor. Monitor means the screen. Right? The TV like screen what we are having is the monitor. So the correct answer is this one. Monitor. Where we just want to see information. Fourth one. A file that the user can open and use. If you have a file which a user can open and use, that is known as a document, we can say. In this case, we can say document is the right one. So document is a file. For example, if you type something in the MS Word that is stored in a file, right? That is what a document when that you can open and you can again edit or modify and you can use it. Question number five. People who operate computers are called the people who operate computers are called users. This is not operators. Don't confuse with the operator. Users. Sixth question. The common keyboard arrangement. In the keyboard, you have three letters, three, three lines of alphabets. The first line is what? Q, W, E, R, T, Y. Right? This is the first. In this layout. That is what we said. Keyboard is in this layout. Seventh question. In in most programs, you press the key to get help. This also we have seen in the previous uh, uploaded files, videos I have explained. F1, when we press, what will happen? It will open the help. F1 is repeated question. F1 for help. Eighth question. A computer CPU consists of millions of tiny switches called, small, small switches contain, the millions of switches are available and that is called as transistors right electronic device this is electronic device we can say or electronic component we can say in the cpu even the cpu itself is very small one inch like this one inch or two inch like this it can say millions of small tiny switches called as transistors nine question cpu uses a dash to store and retrieve each piece of data in memory cpu uses cache we can say right cache is the fastest memory that is available 
either on the cpu or on the mother, on the motherboard where it stores and read the piece of data so answer is cache question number 10 a central computer with a large storage device and other resources which can be shared we have a big computer central computer we can say big computer that is known as mostly server right this is a server this is attached with what i already said before attached with like this many clients will be there or users are attached this one so here resources you have many files available here data available here so these users are accessing right either sending or receiving information like this so that is what we say as file server contains lot of files here these are shared or used by many users the abbreviation bps stands for bps stands for bits per second remember as bits per second mostly refer refer speed transfer speed the expression mbps this also we have seen mbps means what is the expression mbps megabits per second if it is gbps gigabits per second gbps means you have mbps means megabits per second mb we say no uh, a computer signal is digital it consists of on or off pulses representing something like on and off means in computer we know only two things computer understand only thing, two things for example one is for on and zero is for off digital signals one on and off ones and zeros signal then a file if a file is sent if a file is sent from your computer to another person's computer then you are that means this also i said in the previous video when we are sending from one computer to another computer what we say that as uploading a file right sending from one to from our computer to another computer uploading if we receive from here then that is downloading this question is about confusing maybe students confuse with transferring also here next question if the file is sent from your computer the, Here, fifteen question is same given as so. There they have repeated the same question here, same like the previous. If a file is sent from your computer to another computer, right? This is repeated in the mock test itself. Sixteen construction of the network. Initially, networks have started. What is the meaning of network? Connection of computers, right? Interconnection of computers. This is what we said. Network. This has started, and later it has grown to internet. So when the network has started, not the inter question is not on the internet. Question is on the network. When the networks have been started, it is in 1969. Don't confuse this question with the internet. That is different story. Question number 17. A collection of related web pages. Right? When you open a website, it contains many web pages. So a collection of web pages is called as website a website contains many web pages for example if you open a, a newspaper website many pages will come so in that way also you can understand question number 18 every web page has a unique address we know in the top of the web page you see http right something www.com something slash something you will see so every web page has has a unique address called as uniform resource locator maybe sometimes you will get question what is url like this also you will get question so what is url uniform resource locator this every page will have a unique a special address to open it next question the internet acts as for services such as world wide web and email internet acts actually as an infrastructure but infrastructure is not given here so we can write here provider right if infrastructure is given that also you can choose or internet acts as a provider of for services such as www and email 20th question isp stands for internet just now i said internet service provider isp stands for internet service provider so these questions i have taken directly from the website so telangana council of education research and training they have released the mock test all of you 
should attempt this mock test to know how much you are prepared for the upcoming entrance exam right so these questions are from mock test 2025 from the website if you have any doubt mention in the comments do subscribe and share the channel for more information videos thanks for watching